Today we're looking around our 2016 Honda Civic Type R, finished in championship white. This vehicle has covered only 8,693 miles and has had three previous owners in that time. The first owner had it for seven years and covered just 6,500 miles. It was then sold to us back at the end of 2023, where the most recent owner has had it for 2,000 miles. When we had it, we also replaced all four tyres with eager left ones, as the other ones weren't heavily worn, but they had some age-related cracking on them. The vehicle has had seven Honda services, and the MOT isn't due until October of 2025. All the bodywork and wheels are all in really good condition too. So we'll just take a quick look inside now. Starting off with the passenger side, the door card there is all in really good condition, as is the rest of the interior. You also have the red bucket seats and matching red seat belts. And again, they're both in really good shape. Looking behind the passenger now, again, the rear seats are both in really good condition and there is no damage along the backs of the front seats either. Looking in the boot now, the parcel shelf is in really good shape, as is the rest of the boot, with plenty of storage room, as well as an additional compartment underneath here. Looking behind the driver now, again, door card and seats are both immaculate, with the matching mats too. Finally, looking at the driver's side, again, it's all in great condition, the steering wheel there's minimal wear as well, as does the seat. There are a couple of very, very minor creases, but it is fantastic for the age of mileage. Looking at the interior now, starting off on the right, you can see a handful of buttons down there, including one for lane departure warnings. On the main display there, you can see your speed, as well as a handful of other different screens there. And then once you engage R mode as well, the entire display changes color and then you have a handful more options there. On the main wheel, you have a couple of different controls there, as well as automatic wipers and automatic lights. On the main screen, again, a handful of different options for your phone, as well as navigation, a handful of other bits. You've also got dual climate display, which is of course the manual version, and a nice plaque there. Also see the handbook. There's decent cup holder storage, as well as in the center console, we have a handful of different outlets as well. So we'll just let the vehicle warm up and hear how it sounds. So we let the vehicle warm up and now hear how it sounds. I hope that video was informative. If you're interested in purchasing the vehicle, our contact details will appear on the screen shortly.